Hi boys and girls, how are you? Today I thought we could do a craft together. And since there's so many flowers outside blooming, I thought we could make a flower. So I collected what I need, which is construction paper, a glue stick, scissors, and I found in my kitchen drawer some cupcake liners. So this is what I'm gonna to use to make my flower. So the first thing we have to do is think about the parts of a flower, and every flower has a long stem. So I'm gonna take some paper and I'm gonna cut. Now remember, when you use scissors, you always let a grown-up know you're using them. You sit down when you're cutting, thumbs up, and no chicken arms. So here's my stem. Okay, there's my stem. And then every flower has some leaves, so I'm gonna fold my paper in half, so when I cut my leaf, I'm gonna get two with one cut. Now, if you want to, you could take a pencil or a crayon and trace the shape of your leaf, or you can just cut it. So I'm cutting, and watch my arm, tell me if I have no chicken arms, no chicken wings, right? And I'm gonna turn the paper, not the scissor. And here are two leaves. And then every flower has a beautiful head. That's the flower part. This is where my cupcake liners come in. And if you have don't have cupcake liners, you can use paper, you can use whatever you want. And if your cupcake liners or whatever you're using has no color, add it with magic marker. So I'm going to fold it in half, fold it again, and fold it one more time. So it looks like this, and not at the pointed end, but the rounded end. I'm gonna take my scissor, and I'm just gonna cut some squiggly lines. Just some squiggly lines. And then when I open it up, ooh, look at that. That's pretty neat. And I'm gonna do the same thing with my yellow one. I'm gonna fold it in half, fold it in half, fold it in half, let me make it nicer. Gotta take our time. And I'm gonna do a different cut. And I'm gonna make cut lines. Snickers, hello, how are you? Okay, Snickers wants to be in the video. So here's my other flower. That's interesting also. Okay, now we're gonna glue everything down. So I take my glue stick. Now remember, if you're using a glue stick, don't press too hard. Just press enough, and I'm gonna stick the stem. Snickers. Okay, hopefully she's gone. Here's my stem, and then here's my leaves. Put one here, and I'll put one here. Here's my leaves, and now for the best part. I think I'm going to start with my yellow one first. I'm going to glue that down. And then I'm going to glue the red one on top because sometimes flowers, whoop, I need a new glue stick. Sometimes flowers are two, have different colors in them. So here is my flower. I hope you enjoyed making this craft with me. I loved making it with you. I'm going to go put this on my refrigerator. So I'll see you soon, friends. Bye.